My name is Robert Kellogg. I am a former fellow here at Children's and I'm very happy to be a new faculty member at the Department of Neurosurgery. When I first arrived as a fellow, you know, like any new situation, you're never quite sure what to expect or what your exact role will be. Here at Children's, I felt immediately completely integrated into the service and the practice. The program is fairly unique in that we have a graded responsibility model where the beginning of the year starts off as a traditional fellowship with extensive attending, supervision, and coaching in the OR. By the second half of the year, the fellow has assumed attending call and the schedule with the other attendings, but they're seeing the patients independently and formulating their own plans. I think it's a really good way to prepare for independent practice. The fellow gets an immersive experience as a junior faculty member. They're treated as a partner from day one. They get their own clinic. And so at the end of their fellowship time here, they can be completely comfortable tackling any pediatric neurosurgery problem. I was immediately uh, treated with a lot of respect and given a lot of responsibility. And uh, working with all the attendings was very straightforward. They all uh, were very open to talking about cases and how to manage patients, but they always gave me room to manage things and run things how I wanted to within reason and that was one of the most valuable aspects of the fellowship here. I'm incredibly proud of the quality of training and the quality of doctors and neurosurgeons that come out of uh, this uh, uh, program. They have the opportunity to really make a difference in pediatric uh, neurosurgery. I came to Children's Hospital of Pittsburgh because it's a top tier pediatric neurosurgery program and I wanted to be surrounded by excellence. I think that the quality of people that surround you raise you up and we've got a very, very talented group of neurosurgeons here. We have all of the equipment we need to perform pediatric neurosurgery at the highest level. That includes a stereotactic robot, an intraoperative CT scan, intraoperative MRI, stereotactic MR guided laser ablation system, and even micro, a microelectrode recording system for deep brain stimulation. In addition, we have all the neurophysiologic monitoring equipment that we need to perform skull-based surgeries and everything else that you could potentially imagine doing as pediatric neurosurgery. Given that this uh, department is very large, we see many, many patients from Western Pennsylvania, from the state as a whole, from the tri-state area, and also from around the country and around the world. So our faculty become very subspecialized, and this gives us the opportunity to become very good at what we do and provide outstanding care to the patients that come here. This is a top-notch academic program and even if there are a lot of options about where to go, this is one of the few programs where you can observe faculty members who are NIH funded, who are doing top level research, but at the same time have extremely busy clinical practices. One of the things I really loved about the fellowship here at Children's was the wide uh, range and, and types of cases uh, that I got to do here. Um, another advantage was there was a, you know, a relatively low percentage of shunt cases so you got to focus more on the bigger cases, such as tumors or craniofacial or other things. There is really no holes. Some programs don't have functional neurosurgery, or spasticity, or peripheral nerve available. Uh, our fellows get exposure to all of those during the course of the year. And pediatric neurosurgery can become like breathing, which is really what you need to do uh, to go be a successful faculty member uh, wherever you end up going after fellowship. We don't rest on our laurels. We want to make sure that we do better and better and better. The desire to improve and to make a difference is really woven into the fabric of the, this department and that's one of the reasons why I came here, why I'm still here, and the fellowship program in pediatric neurosurgery has all of those characteristics to be able to really maximize the opportunities for the fellow that comes here. A major strength of our children's hospital is the ability to work collaboratively across teams and across disciplines to bring to bear the highest level of care for the children that are evaluated here. Whether it's uh, the nurses in the OR or on the floor or uh, the patient service representatives, everybody is all in for taking care of the kids here. That really made, in a lot of ways, made my job easier as the fellow because I knew that the kids were being well taken care of even when myself or someone from my team wasn't there. What I'm looking for is a fellow that comes here 
and becomes an integral part of our department, but wants to change the future of pediatric neurosurgery. They want to come in, soak as a sponge everything that the environment has to offer, and then go out to another program and one, show the Pittsburgh way, but also to make a difference, for somebody to come with a plan, with hunger, and with the ability and desire to change neurosurgery, so really we can treat uh, pediatric neurosurgery problems better and better. The bottom line is that if you want high volume, rigorous training with high level mentors, uh, this is the best place to be. When you do your fellowship at Children's Hospital of Pittsburgh, you are completely prepared to launch out into your own practice without fear. If you want to get the most out of your fellowship, do the most uh, diverse and complex cases, and have uh, responsibility like you're already in attending, Children's Hospital of Pittsburgh is where you should come.